Hey guys, so I'm here with my end of the month Just Fab haul and review. Pretty much everything that I'm showing you is true to size except for one heel. Um, but other than that, they are the only ones that I had to exchange. So I'm just going to go ahead so and jump right in. So the first heel that I have to show you guys is called um, Aura. And this is very similar to a heel that I had purchased back in March or late February. It looked exactly like this, but it had a pointed toe. So this one is exactly the same shoe, except it is a different material and it has a minimalistic open toe. And I really thought that that was unique. I was already a fan of the original shoe. So when I saw this one, I wanted to get it. And I also liked that it is a tan color with a black suede strap. So that heel um, right there is very comfortable. It's very easy to wear. Um, unlike the first one that I bought, this one is easier for me to buckle. Next shoe that I have to show you is going to be Zara. And Zara is actually a heel that I haven't had a chance to wear because I just got it probably like two or three weeks ago. And this one is a sandal that is open here in the front and it has laces that go all the way through. Um, it has a peep toe and it zips up in the back. What I can tell you is that this shoe is really well made and I have similar shoes like this, but this one is my favorite so far, which is why I went on ahead and ordered it. And um, if it's true to size, it is also a size eight. The next shoe that I have is called Orly. And this is kind of like a floral tropical print heel. And the colors that you're gonna see in this is gonna be coral, teal, you have lime green, you have fuchsia, and you have peach. So the thing that I like about this shoe is that it has a very unexpected medley, medley of colors. And I also would expect it to be just like a really straightforward floral print, but it's not floral print. It's like kind of like a leaf tropical print. So this shoe has a steep heel, but it is easy to walk in and it does fit true to size. And I love any heel that's got any kind of floral or leaf pattern. So this is a shoe that I will definitely keep just because of the simple fact that it is, it has something that I really like. The next shoe that I have to show you, I actually ordered in two colors. So this is going to be Celine and this is a size eight. And I got Celine in white and I also got Celine in black. And um, I wanna say in May, I ordered a very similar shoe called Helen. And if any of you shop just fast, you're probably gonna recognize this type of heel because the shoe that came out earlier, which was called Helen, was only available in black and all of this part was gold and I actually wound up returning Helen because I didn't like the material that the gold part was made of so I was really happy when I saw that they redid the shoe with different material this is actually kind of like a zipper that's going all the way around so I think that that's really cool this shoe does fit true to size um, it's stretchy right here on the side and it also zips up in the back. And this one does have a really tall hill, but it's easy to walk in because it also has a platform. So the last pair of shoes that I have to show you is going to be two shoes that I got um, in two different colors. And this shoe is called Amina. And this is another one of those heels that I told you is a replica of the Louboutins that came out for their spring line. So I'm just gonna hold up the blue one. Um, this shoe, I had to order this one in a seven and a half because it, it just ran big for some reason on me. And I can tell you this shoe is not comfortable. It's not comfortable at all. The heel is really steep and it kind of like causes your feet to just kind of go like way down in here like that. So for me, the most uncomfortable part of the heel was right here where, no, right here, where my big toe would wind up being. It was putting a lot of pressure right there just because of how steep the hill is. But I really like the shoe. I don't have any shoes this color as well as this color in a sandal. So I guess these are good for going out if you don't have to do a lot of walking. If you have to do a lot of walking, you're probably not going to be very comfortable. 
Okay, so I only have one bag to show you guys this month, and it is a bag that was last call. It's called Society Type, and I really liked how this bag looked. It reminded me kind of like a Chanel bag. Um, I liked the tweed fabric that they have here going across the front, as well as this right here. I think that it has really good details. I wound up getting it on sale for $24.95, plus I used the coupon. And um, this bag was on its way out when I bought it, so I don't think that they have it available anymore. But it's pretty big. I thought it was a clutch at first, but when I got it, I was surprised at how big it is. You could fit a lot of things inside of it. And it's also black on the inside. So that pretty much is my haul for June. And today happens to be the first day of summer. So, um, Hope you guys are all having a great day today um, doing really fun things and I will see you guys later. Hey guys, so there was also one quick thing that I wanted to add. Um, I have a Poshmark account and I hadn't been using it but I decided to add a bunch of stuff to it. So if you want to check out my Poshmark account, you're going to be able to find it under Fashion to Live. All of these clothes, shoes and purses have been listed as of this weekend and um, you can also get $5 off if you use my referral code.